I'm Nancy Linruth. I'm a procrastination coach and an EFT or tapping specialist uh, on blockresults.com. And when I first joined, I wasn't really. I had a teeny tiny little hobby business on the side of being a therapist. Yeah. And I, I, I had been saying for years that I was going to grow that coaching practice so I could leave therapy and do what I'm here to do, mm. what I'm really meant to do. Mm. And I gave it my all. I tried so hard. And it got smaller and smaller and smaller. What wasn't working? Nothing, nothing, nothing was working. <laughs> <laughs> well, the reality is I didn't know how to market. Okay. I thought I should be able to figure it out but I, it wasn't working. There's that feeling, especially as women, that we should figure it out on our own because otherwise we look stupid or like we don't know what we're doing, right? So that false pride, like, wasn't working. You found us. Was there any resistance in saying yes? Oh, yes. Oh, yes, yes. Tell us. <laughs> I uh, came to mindset. And I, I realized that what I really needed was to get the training and how to do marketing. But man, it cost a lot. Yeah. And I had this tiny little business that had never paid anywhere near that amount. But I knew that if I didn't do this, nothing would happen with the business. It would go away, basically. And I would always regret that. Mm. So I called my husband up. Mm -hmm. who is very supportive, but he, like me, is like, that much money? Are, are you sure? But I promised I, I, would, I would give it my all. I would do everything. And, and I would see. And if, if, if it worked, then it was worth it. If it didn't, it was still worth it because then I would know yeah. that it wasn't right for me. Yeah. And so you took the leap of faith. Yes. And... What's happened since you joined us? Well, the first year I worked like hell. Mm -hmm. And I, I, did, I changed my website. I did some videos. I did all the things I was supposed to be doing. Because you were coming like from me. a teeny tiny. It was nothing. Right. OK. And so I put all that in place. And I started to see a little bit of change by the end. The next year, I just kept doing what I'd learned, primarily the fastest path to cash, mm -hmm. the networking and the, the speaking and all. And by the end of that year, I compared, and I had made in, this was last year, 2018, I had made seven times what I had made in 2017. Wait, 2018 yes. over 2017. Yes. I multiplied it by seven times. Seven times. Give her a hand. So I kept going. Yeah. And uh, then this year, by February, it was really clear that I was losing money by staying in my therapy practice. Wow. And it was even clear to my husband. And we agreed it was time. So shut that down. And I've, I've made as much this year by June as I had made all of last year. Wow. So. What works about the program for you? I did need to learn about marketing. I mean, I, that, that was Im important, but in fact, that wasn't the most important thing. It really was the, the other piece, the mindset piece that we've all been talking about. Yeah. And the irony is there is, that's what I work on with my clients too. Of course, it's okay. Yeah, like, you know, we myself. do it for others, right? Yeah. Um, but because that is such a present part that is um, helping me remember to work on it when things happen. And, and the reason why it's front and center, I mean, obviously it's part of the curriculum, it's part of what Kiva talks about a lot, but the whole community talks about it. Everyone is aware of it. And so it's not some sort of weird thing. You kind of look around and see if anyone's noticing. It's like everyone is saying, hey, you got to get in the vortex. Uh, or, hey, let's, let's support you with this. Yeah. And it has made me see myself in a totally different way. Uh, I've gone from being this little therapist to like, I'm here. Yeah. I'm meant to change the world. Yeah. So. Tell me about 
Kiva. Oh man, <laughs> Kiva is so wonderful. I want to be Kiva when I grow up. I really do. <laughs> uh, and it's interesting because um, I was at uh, the live meeting in June, and Kiva announced that she was going to do a, a fast track day for for those who wanted to come to Boston. And I called my husband and I said, "Oh, I so want to do this." I mean, and and he listens in. He listens in on the Q and A's, Kiva. And he, he'll tell me afterwards, she's good. She's really good. <laughs> so I called him. I said, "Oh, I wish I could, but I, you know, I can't. I can't justify that." And his answer was, "Are you kidding? You should go. It's going to fast track you. Go!" Wow! Big support as a result. Words of advice: If you're Wanting to grow a business, this is the place for it. Come here, work on your mindset. <laughs> you really have to do it. Mm -hmm. But this community, the 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 people who train you, know their stuff. Yeah. And if you do it, you'll see such changes that you you can't do on your own. You just can't. At least I couldn't. I don't think many people can give themselves a good haircut. <laughs> I think we need to just lay down the expectation that what got us here is going to get us to the next level. And I think there's real bravery and humility in saying, you know what, I tried doing it on my own, and there's nothing wrong with me if I couldn't do it on my own, but I love myself enough to give myself the world-class support that will take me to my next level. Absolutely.